All right, people, we are live on the YouTube. I've got the lobster and I've got the hair. I've wanted to get you guys together. You two have never been seen on camera before. Yeah. As far as you know. Jordan Peterson, welcome back. I, I'm not even gonna mention her name, but if you want it, you can go ahead. Um, is this, is this a political movement? I think that partly what I'm doing in my tour is the fostering of genuine discourse. But I don't think that's a political, I don't think of that as a political movement. I think of it as a psychological movement or, yeah, or, it, I don't know. It's, it's sometimes it's hard to tell, right? And it's, there's a lot of homogeneity with um, the ideology of Canadian universities, though. There's something called the Campus Freedom Index, and it talks about, you know, freedom of speech on campus, and no Canadian schools do particularly well at all. I know Wilfrid Laurier has, across the four criteria, I believe just Ds and Fs. Let's just talk about Peterson for a second. Peterson is highly involved with the alt-right. No one disputes that. Yeah. There's actually a corrupt literature that's associated with this because I was promoting the idea that, you know, perfectly innocent women would be lined up by the state and distributed en masse to undeserving males so yeah. that they wouldn't be violent. We've only know. done that at one show, right? That was good. That was good. It worked really well, too. But people are, are in for that. They're, they're, they're on board for that. I can't even process how you think that way. It just doesn't make sense. What are we supposed to make of this? I'm still under the impression he's not involved with the alt-right. <laughs> yes, well, <laughs> yes. Lindsay Shepard is part of the alt-right. That's just quite ludicrous. So. <laughs> She's not stupid. And yet, no one seems to know that. You know, I, I just don't agree intellectually where these ideas come from. And I don't like it when people condescend me. And so I treat people with that same respect. But I find it condescending to say that you know, you can't handle an idea. Well, what the hell do you want exactly mm -hmm. from your leftist perspective? Um, I didn't know then and I still don't know now. Yeah. Yeah. You're alone and vulnerable. And so there's some strength in numbers there that might be usefully applied. Don't worry, we're not recording this. <laughs>